you know, Jesus Christ went to hell. Alright? It says, Thou wilt not leave my soul in hell, neither wilt thou suffer thine holy one to see corruption. That would be in the book of Acts, uh, forget exactly, the beginning of the book of Acts, first few chapters, it's in, I think it might be the second chapter. But it's also in the book of Psalms. Uh, near the beginning of the book of Psalms, you're going to see um, that Jesus Christ is a direct quote from that book. And when I studied the, book, the, the word hell and different things like that, back in the day, I come to a whole new conclusion. Because a long time ago, um, basically, I taught and I preached from the pulpit one time that, you know, Jesus went to paradise and he didn't go to hell and this and that. Now, Jesus Christ did not go to paradise after he died. All right, that's what I was speaking about. After he died, was buried, and when he was buried, it says his soul went to hell. If you study the word hell and different things within the word uh, or hell, there's nowhere, anywhere that you can find in the scriptures hell being talked about as a good place. There's nowhere in the scriptures, all right, that you, you'll find that. Hell is always damnation, uh, you know, and so forth, when it's talking about the literal fiery hell and, and, and things like that. Now, I learned that when I read a book, um, uh, Oliver B. Green, teaching that, okay, that Christ went to paradise, and then he, he brought paradise up into heaven, and all this stuff, and so forth. I can't stay on this too long, because we're going to get through this, but um, it's just, it's nowhere in the scriptures. It's nowhere in the scriptures. You take scripture totally out of context, and taking maybe one or two scriptures that might kind of hint towards something that. You, you might be able to put your spin on it and say, oh, well, you know, that would, you know, blah, blah, blah. But, no, you know, it's not true. So, he's, if you go to hell and you don't believe on Jesus Christ as your Savior and die in your sins, you're going to be in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. When we 